Dubai attracts celebrities from far and wide for its glamour and extravagance. But what if I told you that some of your favorite celebrities are not allowed to set foot in that country? Sounds unbelievable, right? Join us in this video as we reveal the surprising names of 10 celebrities who have been banned from Dubai. Number 10. Rolf Buchholz First up, we have Rolf Buchholz. He's a German computer expert known for his extraordinary appearance. Well, he has 453 piercings on his body and face, as well as horn implants on his forehead. The man gained worldwide recognition in 2012 when the Guinness Book of Records declared him the most pierced man on Earth. But his unique appearance caused him a lot of trouble during his trip to Dubai. In 2010, Rolf was invited to Dubai to perform at a circus-themed nightclub. However, he was unaware that his tour would be filled with strange encounters. He arrived at the Dubai airport and had his passport stamped and approved. But then, Rolf was stopped before entering customs, and he was then forced to board a flight to Istanbul. The airport staff allegedly expressed fears that he might be involved in black magic, and they banned him from entering Dubai. Can you believe it? Rolf was baffled, and he was desperate to seek answers about what was wrong. Unfortunately, he received no official response from the authorities. Even the nightclub he was scheduled to perform at in Dubai expressed their disappointment, and they apologized as they were unsuccessful in getting him into the country. He later on posted about the whole incident on Twitter, and let's just say he was pretty upset about the entire drama. Rolf vowed never to return to Dubai. Because of the sudden deportation, he had to leave his luggage and it got lost somewhere at the airport. The story was mind-blowing, and his restriction was utterly unexpected. The reasons behind the decision were never officially disclosed, and this has left many people curious about the truth behind this strange incident. Rolf's global recognition was not much help to get him through the customs. And the next celebrity on the list was denied entry to a very unexpected place, specifically because of his profile. Number 9. Andrew Tate Andrew Tate is a name that never fails to incite controversy, and that means he's banned from some surprising places. From Dubai to certain schools in the UK, doors have been closed to him. It's like a whirlwind of prohibitions following his every step. One significant incident that stands out is his barring from a school in Dubai. Back in May 2023, an email surfaced from a student. He experienced the wrath of Andrew Tate's reputation in the UAE. The student shared how he was misunderstood as a misogynistic person in school because of his association with Andrew. And after that, things escalated quickly. Multiple teachers held meetings with that student, and they tried to convince him to quit the real world, an organization linked to Andrew Tate. Shockingly, the school even called in the student's older brothers and parents for a meeting and things got out of control. The school accused the student of engaging in activities that could lead to the entire family's deportation and ruin their business. It is heart-wrenching how these misunderstandings can spiral into chaos. The student was even labeled misogynistic for interacting more with male teachers than female teachers. Ridiculous, right? They even mentioned moments when he was tired in class, and the school blamed it on Andrew Tate and assumed that it was due to his illegal work. But here's the catch. The student denied all the accusations. He stated they were mere lies with no truth behind them. The school didn't bother to investigate. They simply fed into the hate towards Andrew Tate. And to make matters worse, they took some of Andrew Tate's jokes way too seriously. As for now, things look really messy. Only time will tell what lies ahead for the social media sensation. While Andrew Tate faced the ban due to his controversial reputation, the next renowned artist on our list encountered travel limitations for his activism. Number 8. Walid Rod Meet Walid Rod, the founder of the Atlas Group and an associate professor of art at the Cooper Union. 
Coming from Lebanon, he is an influential contemporary artist known for his thought-provoking work. His creative endeavors also took him down a path of activism, and that led to a surprising travel limitation. In May 2015, he was on his way to the Sharjah Art Foundation's March meeting. But the art world was stunned as news spread about a travel ban imposed on Walid Rod. And this ban prevented him from going to Dubai. But what was the purpose of this restriction? Walid's ban was found to be linked to his support for the Gulf Labor Campaign. This group was fighting for better labor conditions. Authorities in the UAE were drawn to his initiatives in advocating for labor rights and ethical working conditions. None of that sounds like a bad thing, right? But Walid Rod wasn't even the only one affected. In fact, he was the third member of the Gulf Labor Campaign to face the restriction. Previously, other artists and cultural figures were also barred from Dubai for their association with the labor campaign. Some of the notable personalities who were included in the no-entry list were Ashok Sukumaran, the architect and media artist, and Andrew Ross, the Scottish social activist and professor at NYU. Despite Walid's extensive history of working in the region, he was not allowed to enter Dubai upon his arrival at the airport. The art community, Walid included, was left in disbelief when security reasons were given as the grounds for the prohibition. It's interesting to see how artistic expression and activism can sometimes collide with travel restrictions, even for individuals who have contributed positively to the region. Unlike Walid Rod's travel prohibition connected to his noble mission, the next renowned personality is concerned about entry problems in Dubai due to a new regulation. Number 7. Orafi Javed Orafi Javed is the Indian fashion-forward actress who's no stranger to the news media. She's often trolled for her fashion sense and statements. But this time, it's an entirely different story. The reason for her sudden limelight is rather shocking. She can never travel to Dubai. Recently, the actress took to her official Instagram account to share the distressing news. But why was she banned? Well, to everyone's surprise, the UAE had adopted a new rule. And this rule prohibits people with single names on their passports from entering the country. And guess what? Unexpected problems surfaced following her name update to Urofi on official paperwork. Leaving out her surname Javed from those records has complicated her travel plans. However, this is not the first time that Urofi has had a brush with Dubai's law. She has a track record of entanglements with the legal system. Back in 2022, her journey to Dubai took an unfortunate turn. She was detained by Dubai police while filming a video in public. That wasn't what they were angry about, though. The reason behind her detainment was her clothing. She was told that it was provocative and not authorized for public recording. Rofi Javed has a bold and rebellious style. She was apparently caught filming in an open area, and her attire didn't align with Dubai's guidelines. Her passport troubles are worrisome, but the consequences weren't as severe as the ones the next celebrity on her list had to face. Number 6. Maddie Healy The band 1975 made headlines in 2019, and it was their first ever show in Dubai. But wait a moment. There's a surprising twist to this story that will leave you speechless. Things didn't exactly turn out the way the band had hoped. During their electrifying performance, the 1975's frontman, Matty Healy, was in the spotlight. Matt suddenly hopped down into the crowd, and he kissed a male concert goer. That would have been seen as pretty innocent in America, but in Dubai, the authorities had a different view. In a surprising turn of events, this act had serious implications. And he didn't expect that. You see, the UAE has strict laws against public displays of affection. Moreover, homosexuality is illegal, and it carries a potential 10-year prison sentence. And that's how this gesture became a challenge to the country's policies. After the concert, Matty Healy took to Twitter and expressed his love for the fans. But he hinted that the band might not be welcomed back due to his behavior. He seemed unapologetic about his actions, 
and he emphasized that he would not have done anything differently even if he was given the chance again. The whole situation goes beyond a simple kiss between two individuals. It sheds light on two issues. First, homophobia in the region. And second is the potential dangers faced by the fan involved. Many concert attendees expressed their concerns online, and they feared for the fan's safety if his identity became widely known. On the other hand, some supporters praised Matty Healy's act, and they called it a revolutionary moment for a historically anti-LGBTQ nation. Matty Healy's behavior posed a challenge to prevailing policies, and the next celebrity on the list faced legal trouble at Dubai Airport. Number 5. Mohammed Asif Mohammed Asif, the skilled Pakistani right-arm pacer, traveled to Dubai with high hopes in 2018. Little did he know that it would take an unexpected turn. Unfortunately, as he reached Dubai Airport, a series of unfortunate events awaited him, and he found himself being deported. The airport officials demanded a crucial letter from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, but Asif was supposed to receive that document in Abu Dhabi. Despite his best efforts to explain the situation, he could not hand over the letter, and this left the authorities with no choice but to take drastic action. He was asked to board the next flight to Pakistan. Asif's trip to Dubai was for participation in a prestigious cricket league. However, his past history had a way of catching up with him at the most inopportune times. Nearly a decade ago, he had faced a similar fate. He was caught with drugs at the same airport. This incident not only tarnished his reputation, but also strained his relations with the city. For Asif, Dubai had become a place fraught with challenges and brutal memories. Unlike Mohammed Asif's rocky past, the next celebrity's ban was all down to his behavior. Number 4. James Kodak Next up, we have James Kodak, the drummer of the German rock band Scorpions. Looking back to the year 2014, a notable event unfolded involving the highly skilled drummer of the Scorpions. This incident involved him being sentenced to a month of imprisonment in Dubai. This raised eyebrows across the music world and beyond. And the reason? He raised his middle finger. That's not so offensive in America, but in Dubai, they saw it as an insult to Islam. The incident became a clash between personal conduct and cultural sensitivity. Adding to the complexity, it came to light that he was intoxicated with alcohol at that moment. Dubai is known for its strict adherence to cultural norms and its deep respect for religious sensitivities, and James Kodak's actions became a point of contention that had far-reaching implications. This incident occurred at Dubai Airport in April 2018 when the band was en route to Bahrain for a concert. According to various reports, the turmoil began with a disturbance in the transit hall. The legal proceedings that followed sent him to jail for a month. And this sparked discussions on the responsibilities of public figures and the need for cultural awareness, especially in foreign settings. Many witnesses testified against him. They mentioned that he made offensive remarks about non-educated Muslims, and that might explain why his hand gesture was considered obscene. Shockingly, he was also heard shouting that he would not travel with a group of Pakistani and Afghan passengers. This further added fuel to the fire, and the charges against him became more serious. In his defense, Kodak denied the charges of insulting Islam, and he stated that he would never utter such offensive words, even under the influence of alcohol. However, he did admit to drinking alcohol without a license and was fined. Despite the denial, James Kodak was arrested. He was released on completing his term and was deported a few days later to the UK. James Kodak's behavior was uncalled for, but the next person on our list was banned even though she didn't do anything like what James did. Number 3. Gigi Lauren, aka Gigi Gorgeous Gigi Lauren is a YouTuber, actress, and model. She's also transgender and is known for her vibrant spirit and openness about her transition. You've probably already guessed why she was tangled in an unexpected situation in the Middle East. Well, Gigi was caught off guard when she faced the reality of being transgender in Dubai. It turns out that she had no idea about the consequences. 
In certain Middle Eastern countries, being transgender has certain life-threatening consequences. While she was in Dubai back in 2016, Gigi found herself being held by immigration officers at the airport. They had found out about her transition, and the officials informed her that she could not enter the country. But the story didn't end there. The situation got even more complicated. Her passport, which had been updated to reflect her gender and name, was deemed invalid by airport officials. They claimed her passport still indicated she was male, showing a picture from her pre-transition days. Now, let's shed some light on Dubai's laws. The United Arab Emirates is one of 77 countries with anti-LGBTQ laws, and Dubai follows strict regulations. One such law prohibits the imitation of women by men. This targets transgender individuals. And these laws essentially make transitioning a challenge. The news spread like wildfire, and the public had mixed reactions to the whole fiasco. Some were quick to criticize Gigi. They stated she should have known the laws before traveling. People even argued that she wasted her time and money and created unnecessary drama. But Gigi's fans came to her rescue. They defended her right to be herself and supported her. Gigi Lauren's passport was one of the reasons she faced trouble in Dubai. And the next celebrity on our list knows all about that too. Number 2. Rachaya Napakaroon Rachaya Napakaroon is a courageous and determined Thai model who embarked on a challenging journey. But she was unaware that her aspirations of showcasing her talents at Dubai Expo 2020 would morph into a harrowing ordeal and it would test her resilience. In an unsettling twist, Rachaya found herself subjected to a relentless nine-hour-long interrogation at the Dubai International Airport. The moment of excitement and anticipation quickly transformed into a grueling experience, and this led to her eventual deportation. But what's the reason behind this heartbreaking incident? Her gender did not match the marker on her passport. Rajaya had all her travel documents in order, including a valid visa, but her dream to perform at Expo 2020 was shattered by immigration officials. She was stuck in a men's holding room, and Rachaya faced intrusive questions from the immigration staff. They demanded to know if she was a man, despite her identification as a woman. This took a toll on her. She was hoping for a glimmer of compassion. But the immigration officials insisted that her passport listed her gender as male, and this required a gender marker change to enter the UAE. However, this task was impossible for Rachaya Napakaron. See, Thailand's laws do not allow transgender people to change their legal gender, so there was nothing she could have done to satisfy the demands of the Dubai authorities. Unlike Rachaya Napakaroon's passport issue, the next celebrity faced legal trouble for a serious offense. Number 1. Cass Crosley Next in line is the story about Love Island finalist Cass Crosley. The 27-year-old British reality star found herself entangled in a situation that would send shockwaves through her personal life. She was arrested in Dubai on suspicion of drug offenses. The star was put into a Dubai prison and she had a prolonged stay of at least three months. What began as a high-profile life filled with glamour and fame took an unforeseen turn for Kaz Crosley. She faced a daunting reality. The question that looms is, how did this series of events unfold? How did a Love Island finalist and a personality familiar with the spotlight be embroiled in such a life-altering state? Well, Kaz was detained at Abu Dhabi Airport while en route to Thailand. She claimed to be going for voluntary work. However, her name raised a red flag during passport checks, leading to her arrest. In 2020, Kaz Crosley and other influencers flocked to Dubai amid the COVID-19 restrictions in the UK, and they stated that they were there for work. During her trip, she was filmed appearing to snort lines of white powder. And this likely contributed to the situation. After she was arrested, her communication with her family was restricted. However, she was granted permission to send a single email. Dubai recently made changes to its drug laws for first-time offenders. 
they have to face a minimum of three months in prison and hefty fines. Previously, the punishment for drug use was a minimum of four years behind bars. So, in a way, it could have been worse. After serving her sentence, Kaz Crossley was deported and she was banned from ever returning to Dubai. The dazzling Dubai can sometimes become a stage for perplexing encounters that leave celebrities puzzled and disappointed. But our list of intriguing stories doesn't end here. If you're interested in more surprising celebrity stories, check out our videos about rappers who got foreclosed on.